home. I know Red Band would definitely try it. So. I wouldn't try ice cubes. That would make it shrink and be sad. Well, whatever the fuck. Maybe somebody stepped on your dick at an MMA contest. Wouldn't dry yeah. ice burn your dick? Yeah. Well, that's some people like that shit. Look, 20 years ago, I went to a club to get Quaaludes. And I walked in. I'll never forget. This. It, was like a, it was called Ramrod. It was a gay bar in the city. And we were kids. We were like 18. That's the first time I seen a dude with a cape on. I thought it was the coolest fucking thing in the world. A man had a cape on. And I walked into this club, and before we walked in, there was a fetish club on the side, and there was a guy in a tub that had a sign on him that said, uh, spit on me. That was his fetish, for people to spit on him. Wow. So here's the beauty. I'm standing there. You know, your jaw's going. You're drinking. You know, you had to pee. And all of a sudden, I see 20 guys standing in line for the fucking bathroom. And I ask one, I go, listen, why don't you just ask the guy in the tub if we could pee on him? So I walked over to the guy. Can I ask you a question? Do you mind if we pee on you? The guys go right ahead. There was a point in the night I looked at him. He had a circle of guys. Just You know those guys that don't want to wait on line? Like, fuck it. Just pee on him. When I left, the guy had three inches of pee in the fucking tub. The sign was all fucking melted. Like the black ink would have been melted. What? It was This guy wanted people to spit on him. We ended up pissing on him. Man. And I pissed on him. I'm guilty of it. I don't give a fuck. He didn't suck my dick or nothing. I would piss on anybody. Oh. I don't give a fuck. He seems like the luckiest man alive. Oh, please. But that's a crazy ass fetish. But you oh. never know. Some people's chicken is another man's gumbo. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I don't like pissing on myself. But this guy wanted you to piss and spit on him. So wow. Fuck him. What is that? That's crazy shit. That's crazy shit. That when I was in Seattle on Wednesday nights at the comedy club, they had a fetish club afterward. And there's a couple times I stayed. People are fucking crazy. It ain't my bag of tricks, you know. But yeah. people are crazy. They put like uh, clips on their nipples and all that. I'm not into that fucking shit. But some some people are. You know? Where's all that shit coming from? What's all, what's all that come from? I don't know. The same people who are in hoarders. I don't know. I don't know where these people fucking come <laughs> it's from. It's just a broken brain, like someone who just wants to shock the shit out of everybody. I don't know. Like sometimes you're sitting there going, wow, I need some action in my sex life. Fucking people in the ass just ain't enough no more. I just Let want me to go lay around and have people piss all over me. Yeah, like all that shit or, or <laughs> come on fuck, me or, fuck, man. or light my ball. And it wasn't really the guy. That wasn't what, what the guy's intentions were. The guy just wanted people to spit on him. Wow. I just took it to the next level because... I'm crafty like that. How about dudes who like uh, girls to beat the fuck out of yeah, them? Yeah, there's people who are there's into that There's a lot stuff. of them. A lot of them. Dudes who like girls to beat the shit out of them. Kick them in the balls. Punch them in the face. It's fucking... There's so many videos online. Dudes love that shit. I go for it until like the third smack and I lose my mind. I fucking <laughs> punch her right in the throat. You know what I'm saying? What, are you uh, fucking kidding me? That's a weird instinct. That is wanna, very fucking weird. fight with chicks and smack them around. Or for them to smack the fuck out of you. Yeah. But what are you going to do? There's people that are animals all over, you know? There's people that only fight with their spouses. They don't fight with other